everyone, Ian here at Able City in Burbank, and today I have a quick tip on how to load cube files or 3D LUTs into the Sony Venice. To get started, I'm going to take an SD card with the contacts facing out, put it into the Venice. You'll get a green confidence that it's been loaded. Push menu for three seconds. Go to timecode media, then format media, SD card. I've loaded my formatted SD card, put it on the desktop, open it up, and you can see I have a folder structure that will end in a LUT folder. I have a folder here with a cube file that I created in LiveGrade. I'm just going to take this Coral 1 and I'm going to load it onto my SD card. Now I'm ready to go back to Venice. I have my SD card loaded in the camera. I'm going to go and hit the menu button for three seconds. And I'm going to go to the shooting menu, which is the first menu that you see. Open this up, and I'm going to go down to let select first. And you're going to see that I'm going to apply the look on SDI 3 and 4. Back out of there. And now I need to go to look file. I need to load the user 3D LUT, which is the one I just put on the SD card. Select it. This is asking where do I want that uh, LUT to appear. These are all the uh, factory preloads. You can see that there's 16 positions here. I'm going to select number one. And now it's asking me what uh, LUT do I want to put on there. I'm going to put my Coral One Cube. You can see the date and time that it was generated. And now if we go and look at our output from SDI 3 and 4, you're going to see that, in fact, I now have my coral look. And that's just how fast you can load a 3D LUT into the Sony Venice. Thanks for watching. I'll see you again soon.